Have you ever wondered about the mysteries that lie hidden in our past? Just like a time-worn book, our world is filled with tales waiting to be unearthed. Archaeologists and scientists, our dedicated storytellers, spend countless hours working to decipher these narratives. Yet, some stories remain untold, their secrets locked away in the depths of history. These enigmatic tales are often born from the most mysterious archaeological artifacts, finds that defy explanation even in the face of our most advanced scientific methods. These artifacts serve as a testament to our past, a window into civilizations long gone. They remind us that history is not always as we perceive it to be. There are still countless tales waiting to be discovered, understood, and shared. These are the stories that challenge us, that make us question our understanding of history and our place within it. Are you ready to delve into the world of the most mysterious archaeological artifacts? Let's begin our countdown. Have you heard of the Baghdad Battery, an ancient artifact that might just prove that our ancestors knew a thing or two about electricity? This perplexing item was unearthed in the early 1900s, near the capital city of Iraq. The artifact, a simple clay pot, contains a copper tube and an iron rod, elements which some believe could have been used to generate an electrical charge. Several theories have been proposed to explain the purpose of this device. Some suggest it was a primitive form of battery, possibly used for electroplating precious metals. Others believe it might have been a tool for religious rituals, creating a tingling sensation that could be interpreted as a divine sign. But the truth is, we're still not sure. Despite our most advanced scientific techniques and brightest minds, the Baghdad battery's true purpose remains elusive. While the purpose of the Baghdad battery remains a mystery, it certainly gives us a lot to ponder about ancient technology. What if I told you there's a book that no one in the world can read? The Voynich Manuscript is just that. This cryptic book, discovered in the early 20th century by antique bookseller Wilfred Voynich, has baffled linguists, cryptographers and historians alike for over a hundred years. Written in an unknown language or cipher, the Voynich Manuscript is filled with bizarre illustrations of alien-like plants, astronomical diagrams and strange naked figures. Its pages are a labyrinth of riddles that, despite our best efforts, we've yet to solve. From the CIA's top codebreakers to the most brilliant minds of the academic world, countless have tried to decipher the manuscript's secrets, yet all have failed, leading some to speculate that it could be an elaborate hoax. Others still believe it's a genuine relic of a lost civilization or secret society. The Voynich manuscript remains a mystery, a silent testament to a secret language or code that we may never crack. Imagine finding a computer in an ancient Greek shipwreck, that's what the Antikythera mechanism is often compared to. This intricate device, discovered in the early 20th century, is a marvel of ancient engineering. With over 30 interlocking, precisely cut bronze gears, the mechanism's complexity is on par with that of a 19th century Swiss watch. Historians believe it dates back to the 2nd century BC, making it far ahead of its time. Speculations about its use range widely. Some suggest it was an astronomical calculator used to predict celestial events like eclipses, while others propose it was a navigational instrument for sea voyages. Its origin is another puzzle. While many attribute it to the Greeks, some suggest possible influences from ancient cultures like the Babylonians or Egyptians. Despite the detailed studies and numerous theories, the Antikythera mechanism remains one of the greatest enigmas of the ancient world. The Antikythera mechanism, a marvel of ancient engineering, continues to baffle scientists and historians alike. The Shroud of Turin, a religious artifact or an ingenious medieval forgery. The debate rages on. This beguiling piece of cloth bearing the faded image of a man was first documented in the 14th century in Turin, Italy. It's said to be the burial shroud of Jesus Christ, with some believers claiming the image was imprinted on the fabric at the moment of his resurrection. But here's where things get tricky. Carbon dating tests conducted in the 1980s suggested the shroud was created between the years 1260 and 1390, casting doubt over its authenticity. However, opponents argue that these tests were flawed, pointing to historical records, pollen studies, and the complexity of the image as evidence of its ancient origins. The debate about the shroud's authenticity is as enduring as the relic itself. Despite numerous studies, the truth about the Shroud of Turin remains veiled in mystery. In the jungles of Costa Rica, hundreds of nearly perfect stone spheres continue to puzzle archaeologists. These remarkable artifacts known as Las Bolas or the Balls 
were first discovered in the 1930s during agricultural activities. Ranging in size they can be as small as a tennis ball or as large as a car, and they're almost perfectly round. The precision with which these spheres were crafted is astounding, considering they date back to around 600 AD, a time when advanced tools were not available. The spheres are made of granodiorite, a hard igneous rock. The question of how the ancient Costa Ricans shaped and polished these stones into such perfect spheres, is a mystery that continues to intrigue researchers. As for their purpose, theories abound. Some suggest they were used for astronomical purposes, others think they were status symbols. Despite various conjectures, definitive evidence is yet to be found. What the stone spheres of Costa Rica were used for, or how they were made, remains an enigma. In the barren plains of Nazca, Peru, enormous geoglyphs etched into the earth hide their secrets from us. Discovered only in the 20th century, these stunning formations called the Nazca Lines stretch across an area of nearly 1,000 square kilometers. Their scale alone is mind-boggling but their complexity is what truly astounds. Over 300 figures ranging from simple geometric shapes to intricate representations of animals and plants are carved into the earth. Theories about their purpose and creation are as diverse as the lines themselves. Some suggest that these could be astronomical calendars, while others believe they might be ancient pathways or spiritual symbols. The mystery deepens when we consider the precision required to create these designs without the benefit of an aerial perspective. Despite ongoing research, much about the Nazca Lines remains unknown. How were they created? What purpose did they serve? The Nazca Lines, an impressive testament to an ancient culture, continue to confound researchers. From baffling manuscripts to unexplained stone spheres, these artifacts remind us that history is full of mysteries waiting to be uncovered. Our journey through history and the mysteries it holds has taken us from the ancient city of Baghdad, through the parchment pages of the Voynich manuscript, to the intricate gears of the Antikythera mechanism. We've marveled at the enigmatic Shroud of Turin, pondered over the spherical stones of Costa Rica, and gazed in awe at the Nazca line stretching across the Peruvian desert. Each artifact, a testament to the ingenuity and complexity of our ancestors, yet each one holding its secrets close, refusing to fully reveal the truth of its existence or purpose. The Baghdad battery with its potential for primitive electricity, challenges our understanding of technological progression. The Voynich manuscript with its indecipherable text and peculiar illustrations, makes us question the limitations of language. The Antikythera mechanism, a sophisticated device found in an ancient shipwreck, forces us to reconsider the timeline of scientific advancement. The Shroud of Turin, with its haunting image, leaves us questioning the intersection of faith and science. The stone spheres of Costa Rica, perfectly round and painstakingly created, challenge our comprehension of artistic dedication and purpose. And the Nazca lines, visible only from great heights, baffle us with their scale and precision, making us wonder about the capabilities of ancient societies. Each of these artifacts, while unique in their mystery, share one common thread. They remind us that our past is rich with unanswered questions and unexplored possibilities. These artifacts beckon us to keep digging, to keep questioning, to keep exploring the depths of our history. They underscore the importance of archaeology and scientific research in unearthing the secrets of our past and understanding our journey as a species. As we continue to dig into our past, who knows what other mysteries we might unearth.